Hello, and welcome to Zoho People, your online HRIS that lets you manage your workforce. Once you sign up, you can start with configuring your Zoho People account by accessing Setup. Setting up your organization is the first step. Here, you can upload your company logo, fill out your organization profile information, and set up your locale and display. You can add or edit designations and titles under Manage Designation. Add or edit departments under Manage Departments. And add or edit locations under Manage Locations. Remember, whatever you add here will be available to users to set up their profile information. Once you've configured the organizational settings, you can add your employees into the portal. It is important for the administrator to differentiate the organization users. Regular users are your organization's employees who have login IDs to access the self-service portals. Non-users' employee profiles may be contractors or employees who have no access to self-service portals and company information. Zoho Mail users are users who have Zoho Mail accounts. Google Apps users are users who have accounts in Google Apps. Inviting users can be done in three ways. 1. Adding an employee record. 2. Multiple employee addition through email IDs. 3. Adding employees through bulk import. Adding employee record is the manual method, wherein the super administrator can directly key in employee information under the Users tab of the Setup section. Adding multiple email IDs to invite users is also another possibility through the Setup section. Adding users through bulk import can be done by using an XLS or CSV format file. There are instructions for importing on the Users tab of the Setup section. The invitation method varies based on the type of users. The regular users can be added by all three methods. An invitation email to join the portal will be received by the regular users and on acceptance, the employees will reflect in the active list. The non-users can be added by manual entry or bulk import. Remember that to add a non-user, an email invitation is not required. Once a non-user is added, it will automatically reflect in the active list. Adding Zoho Mail and GApps users can be done through the Users tab of the Setup section when you click Import. Now that your employees are added, you can configure the attendance, time-offs, timesheets, and self-service settings. For further assistance, you can write to support at zohopeople.com.